Taylor Swift's most controversial Super Bowl moment involved what might otherwise be considered typical fan behavior. But then, a global superstar pop singer isn't any typical fan. Over the course of the 2023-2024 NFL season, Taylor Swift became a regular attendee of Kansas City Chiefs games, thanks to her blossoming relationship with tight end Travis Kelsey. Some fans loved her appearances at the games, others vocally hated them, and it all seemed to come to a head at the biggest game of the year. During Super Bowl 58, which pitted the Chiefs against the San Francisco 49ers, Swift shared a luxury box at Las Vegas' Allegiant Stadium with A-lister friends, including Blake Lively and Ice Spice. The cameras and the jumbotron caught the pop star at several key moments during the evening. From her cuddling with Lively, to cheering, to gasping about dramatic plays, it was one particular act that resulted in a wave of boos from the fans in attendance. At one point, the Grammy winner was shown on the Jumbotron chugging her beer until it was empty, then triumphantly slamming the empty vessel down in front of her. It seemed most of the hate was coming from 49ers fans, since Swift was obviously rooting for the Chiefs. But the moment was just another example of how polarizing her every move has been this football season, with false rumors even swirling at one point that Swift had been banned from attending the Super Bowl as a result. The criticism of Swift's big beer-chugging moment didn't stop at the boos in the stadium, either. Plenty of people took to social media to share their displeasure as well, much of which centered on whether or not the moment positioned the singer-songwriter as a good influence on her countless young followers and fans. One person posted on X, formerly known as Twitter, Taylor Swift was seen chugging down beer during the Super Bowl last night on live TV. This is y'all role model Swifties? Okay. Another argued, she's advertising drinking, not good for her Swifties. It's worth pointing out, of course, that beer has long been such a focal point of Super Bowl culture that every year, folks look forward to watching Budweiser's ads during the big game. It's also worth noting that Swift herself has been open about abstaining from drinking while working on her globetrotting Eras tour to keep her both at peak performance and health during a stressful and grueling schedule. So was chugging a beer really so off-brand, and was she setting such a bad example? Some fans definitely thought the criticism went too far. Plenty of social media users have been cheering her on, in fact, with the NFL even calling Swift an icon. Some pointed out what seemed to them to be a double standard, considering how many other people, both watching in the stands and from the sofa at home, were also drinking beer during the Super Bowl and lots of other NFL games. One ex-user posted, Beer chugging at Super Bowls is as American as apple pie. Is an American to watch football and not drink beer? Another shrugged, her largest demo is millennials, the youngest of whom are 28. I think their delicate sensibilities are safe. For many fans, the pop star taking a moment to let loose and have fun rang true, especially considering she was coming off some huge Grammy wins. One person posted sarcastically in the face of all the criticism, how dare she have a good time? Another Swift fan asserted, she's a grown woman at a sporting event, women chug beer too. Another agreed, asserting, yep, a beautiful young woman enjoying life with her friends.